they're almost indistinguishable from people that were the early farmers that came maybe about 7,000 years ago to Europe. So, as you can see, even the most advanced European scholars are admitting that Neolithic and post-Neolithic Europeans have nothing to do with modern Europeans physically, and they look more like Africans, meaning that they were black. This means that the claims mentioned at the beginning of the video don't link ancient Egyptians to modern Europeans who are white, but rather to their black predecessors. So, what the results suggest is that a portion of modern Europeans' genetic makeup is derived from these ancient Africans who left the African continent through the Middle East and settled in Europe then. So the early Europeans, we know that by now, they all had blue eyes. So the hunter-gatherers, they all had blue eyes. We haven't found a single hunter-gatherer yet that did not have blue eyes. And they mostly, especially in Western and in Southern Europe, all had dark skin. So basically looking potentially like, like Africans today. But despite that genetic connection, there is no or little phenotypic connection.